it was just one more thing I had to go teach myself. And um, so I, I pulled myself out of leadership and I, I just really read and studied and listened to podcasts and, and observed the good leaders around me and tried to think like, well, what are they doing that I'm, I, didn't, I didn't do? And when I came to Keller Williams, they're all about pouring into people and leadership and they continued to develop that in me and develop that in me. And so it was, you know, books like Multipliers. Um, oh God, that's one of my favorites. And and uh, books by John Maxwell, you know, Simon Sinek, Leaders Eat Last, those sort of things that really taught me servant leadership and how, to, you know, that my role is not to be above and, um, uh, you know, yelling at my employees to do anything or to be controlling anything. It's to, to recognize the inborn talent that people bring to the table and to give them the opportunity to use that in service of what we're trying to do and to support them. There doesn't have to just be one Danny, never be the smartest person in the room, you know, pour everything that you have into the people around you and let them go and do and then like let go and trust.